May I ask for your assistance? Ah, I have no idea. I'm sorry. A wasp's nest. They might attack if someone draws too close or are otherwise provoked. Much like London itself. A map of possible routes taken from the embassy. I thought only Sherlock was capable of this kind of deduction. The spyglass was positioned to watch the windows of the embassy across the road. A capital M signed by someone else's hand. Royal Berkshire Regiment, they had it tough in Afghanistan. His face and neck are swollen, and I can see wasp stings all over the skin. Only his right arm was functional. His left arm was paralyzed in the war. I'm sorry I have bad news. Please do not tell me Hawk is a turncoat. Worse, I have found him dead in his wheelchair, out in the garden. Hmm. How did he die, exactly? He was stung repeatedly by wasps. His body succumbed to anaphylaxis. And that is all you observed? Was there anything suspicious? Well, there was one thing. In his notes I found a handwritten M, but it didn't match Hawk's other writing. Listen carefully, Doctor. Do not investigate further. Do not talk about this matter to anyone, and do not ask questions. Thank you. Now leave it alone. Sinking near Scotland, by the strand for the details. Holmes, I have the translation. Barnes will keep researching. Holmes? Watson? Did you hear me? Barnes gave us a preliminary translation of the book. I think we have a lead. Sherlock, what is it? I find myself burdened. It will come as no surprise that I tend towards obsession. Indeed, obsession of grants me the insights that have become my stock in trade, but my greatest asset. Yet I cannot deny this nature proves as much a hindrance as a boon. It has cost me friends, colleagues, brothers, 
And despite my obsession, as I contend with the matter at hand, no closer to understanding than when we began, I... Well, I must conclude that I am of no worth at all. Without an answer, what use is the question? Sherlock, this is no time for despair. The book is real. Those men went mad. John, I fear that I am as mad as the rest of them. I bore witness to the same events that you did. I saw with my own eyes the inexplicable, the ghastly, and the unnatural. I can attest to their occurrence. So take heart, for it was as real as you or I. And thus, we must persist. Lives hang in the balance. If you cannot see your worth, then trust in me, for I see it. And I know of no other man capable of putting this matter right. Thank you, John. But that I possessed even half your courage. Pray tell, where does our journey end? Ardnamurk, Scotland. Well, shall we be off? Yes, of course. You can apprise me of your actions while we pack. If we don't make land soon, I fear we will join those missing souls. These seas have taken too many, John. Let's stop them from taking more, then. The door won't budge. Barred and barricaded from the inside. Old cannon, probably rusting here since the 16th century. Ouroboros, a snake eating itself, an ancient symbol of eternal renewal. Fresh marks, something scraped along the stone. This door requires a very specific key. Where did the shirt come from? Holmes, look. There's a body here. Not just any body, body it's Ashwatch. He died recently. Scratches, bruises, and stabs, 
all self-inflicted. The infamous curved dagger. It's tied firmly to his hand. Oh, his eyes are gouged out. A broken chain. Something was attached to the end. But he succumbed to all those wounds. A human-sized imprint. Someone fell on their back. This branch was recently broken, the wood is still green. Whatever Ashmat had secured to his chain, he lost it here. Scratches. This mid Interesting occult pattern. What drove him to this dreadful act? I fear we are about to see for ourselves. Sealed shut and seemingly for a long time.
An obsidian heart, masterful work. That's a crafty mechanism and quite ancient. This vessel is covered in dried blood. Oh, I get it. We need fresh blood. And no, I'm not volunteering. Fear not. I think Ashmas can help. Anything to hold blood, Watson? Fine, take my flask. The lever doesn't want to stay on its own. Watson, hold the lever for me. I must investigate. Holmes, watch out! My lever went back up. The doors, Watson! Hold the doors! Ah! We're trapped! Now what? Look around. There must be something we can use. A rather accurate depiction of the human heart. Those holes seem to have a purpose, but I won't risk my arm to find out what.
ready for anything, Watson. It's all right, Watson. It's merely a chest with coins and a dagger, made of obsidian by the looks of it. Use these with care. Let us be the first adventurers to raid a tomb without destroying it. Terrific. Now, onward before they close again. Let us hope our paths converge, Holmes. Speak up! Help me! Holmes! Speak up! Help me! Holmes! Help me! Sherlock! I'm coming! John! John, I'm falling! Keep talking! I'm coming! John! John, I'm falling! Come on, wake up! Uh, thank heavens. What were you doing? What happened? Uh, the world with the stars are so distant. Uh, the sun inverts the earth. It becomes transparent. Sherlock, snap out of it. Nothing is everything. We are so small, inconsequential. A shadow in the dark. I... I think we best go back. You are not well, Sherlock. Uh, no, we are so close. We cannot... You asked that I intervene if I saw you cracking. This is me intervening. With every passing minute, another life is extinguished. We must stop, Rochester. We must end this. Ah, oh, Sherlock, you almost died. Do 
not worry about me, John. You have other men to save. I thought that I'd seen horrors during the war, but this... Careful, Holmes! Sir, are you all right? Uh, no response. Entranced, captivated by the light of the lens. Sherlock, don't touch it. We still don't know what it is capable of. The sheer form of it, the color, it makes me feel uneasy. Black, metallic, and with a characteristic hue. Obsidian yet again. <laughs> this material feels very sturdy. It would take an enormous effort to break like that. Base appears to rotate. Hands off, Holmes. We have no idea of its purpose. That's it! You did it! The lens broke! John, the worshippers, we need to make sure... Of course, I'll see if they're all right. At least this awful mask is breathable. Check her pulse, can you, Watson? As expected, the pulse is elevated, but within normal limits. Her chest is moving fast. She's hyperventilating.
wouldn't mind my trembling hands. Stop there, shipmates! A storm awakens and we've battened down the hatches. Dirty summers, I presume. Nice to put a filthy, sweat-covered face to a name. That's no way to speak to a captain. Sherlock, get down! Watson, you killed him! I... I didn't have a choice. Well, what's done is done. If we do not stop Rochester, Summer's death will be but one of many. Hold on. We need a plan. They made sure no one could enter through the main door. It seems they have placed beam emitters all over the main gallery. Khalid lenses are placed inside the lantern room. They modify the gallery and watch room. One moment, Watson. I'll redraw this blueprint. I know this company. They make Fresnel lenses, essential for any modern lighthouse lantern. Pay for padding. They didn't want their cargo damaged. We shall apply what we just learned, charge the Khalid lenses, and break them with the dagger. That should put a stop to this cursed ritual. All right, good. I confess, I worry about what awaits us. Is it too much to hope this will all come right? If our future is black, it is better surely to face it like a man than to attempt to brighten it by mere will-o'-the-wisps of the imagination. Come on. We'll go together. Look at them all. We have to help them. Watson, stop. Rochester will see you. What should we do? We get answers. Stay here. See to the lenses. I shall confront Rochester. He owes me the truth. Sherlock! Sherlock! Mr. Holmes, you are late. 
Was the path here not as you anticipated? You expected me? We've stood here before, Mr. Holmes. Another you, another me. Many years ago. I wonder what will happen this time. What? What are you talking about? Join me. Bear witness to the end. bear witness to anything, Lord Rochester. You are blind. Oh, how? How could you? It is what I do. No. How could you be so ignorant? For I have never seen more clearly than in this moment. Never felt more than I feel right now. Every fiber of the earth, every molecule reverberates in anticipation of the awakening. The vile madness rises in our throats just as our master rises below. I see moon beasts, night gaunts, a witch doctor in Arkham. I see what the stars themselves are dreaming. I know more than any man has ever known. You are delusional. How did you do it? The compulsions, the visions, was it some form of hypnosis or no? A drug, perhaps. Tell me. Ah! There is no ruse. There is no big reveal. It is exactly what it seems. You still fight so desperately against this truth, but you feel it too. Yes? Yes? You are mad. You have mistaken hallucinations for reality. Are you really one to talk, Mr. Holmes? Speak truthfully now. In the port. In the swamp. What did you see? Something beyond the capacities of my imagination. Our world so alien, but... But so familiar. Yes, I see it too, in your mind's eye. Untold horrors lick their lips in the shimmering dreamlands as Sarnath sinks eternal. Ah! 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 Ah!
Something is missing here. Interesting. This could prove useful. to achieve with all this slaughter to these people deserve such suffering they are just tools their existence is meaningless unless put to use oh all-seeing master oh grand god beneath how he has blessed them with purpose you use them for cruelty i've seen a man eat his own flesh just to hear the whispers of lizards I've seen a mother behead her newborn, that she might travel to another world. Galaxies swallow each other whole. Light falls in on itself until nothing remains. You know not cruelty, Mr. Holmes. Cruelty is for such knowledge to be beyond the reach of so many. This is hubris delusion, you are Icarus flying too close to the sun. No, no. You misinterpret the legend, Holmes. Icarus flew. He reached heights no man had ever reached. One must imagine Icarus happy. He burned. Rochester plummeted to his death. And were you to ask him of his choice, he would have not a single regret. Every step I took was necessary. Every drop of blood a blessing. Every death predestined. Surely you understand. It was for knowledge, the only thing worth living for. Why must you remain so blind? Be honest. What is it you fear? I... I am afraid that it will cost me my sanity, much as it has cost you yours. There is no such thing as sanity. There is only the world as it is, and one's willingness to accept it. Yeah! 
you, you truly believe it. That a god arises from below that the world shall end. There is only nothingness. Only chaos and torture and endless time stretching its wings, baring its teeth. It's preposterous. It's nonsense. It's... You... You drug me. Uh, the fumes in the temple, narcotics, are a bad reaction. Oh, you're one of my cross agents. Yes. Yes, this has the stink of my brother all over it. No, 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 wait. Of course. I am dreaming in the asylum. Uh, I'm in Black Edelweiss. Uh, tied to a chair. You are standing right here, Holmes, as you always do. You said that before. You said we had met, but I've never seen you before in my life. The cycle repeats. Old becomes new, and we remain pawns in the hands of a god. Submit! Submit to your inconsequence! It is, it is unthinkable. It is undeniable. I cannot. When you have eliminated all which is impossible, then whatever remains, however improbable, must be the truth. Now, Holmes, now is the moment. You know it in your heart. Say it. Say it. It's... It's real. All of it, it's... It's real. Maybe your god is unstoppable, but you are merely a man, and I know how to stop you. What do you mean? What have you done? I have made a friend. Yeah! No! Curse you! Oh, great one, forgive me! It is over, Rochester. I thought this time would be different, but the gods laugh at man's arrogance. Sherlock, come back down! The wave! Come with us! Turn yourself in! Save yourself! The abyss calls for me, Mr. Holmes, as it does for you. The final problem approaches, and you too shall fall! Sherlock, please! Rochester, don't! Such heights we reach! No! God! Sherlock, we must get inside! I have to see it, John! I have to know! Apologies, did I rouse you? I could relocate to the study, but I wanted to be at hand should you need me. I don't know. No. The sound of your keys uh, is my tether back to the waking world. I find writing of our adventure helps me too. Perhaps at some point you could read it and tell me if it accords with your memory. 
There are moments in our journey that only you were privy to. Your encounter with Gygax, your visions with Light of the Abyss, your confrontation with Rochester. No. Pardon me? Do not publish it. It would be professional suicide. Uh, you would be a laughing stock, a fabulist, concocting penny dreadfuls for the unwashed masses. And I... Well, I would no longer attract a distinguished clientele, but madmen convinced I could connect them to their deceased relatives or help them capture a fairy. Ah. It doesn't seem to get any better, does it? When I close my eyes, John, I am falling. Falling into a black abyss. It is endless and suffocating and unforgiving. I would give for a dreamless night. It's going to be all right, Sherlock. What is that? It will help you rest. No, 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 no not that, no, no. I say, Watson, would you be afraid to sleep in the same home as a lunatic, a man with softening of the brain, an idiot whose mind has lost its grip? Not in the least. lucky.